the matrix I perceive as real. The matrix I perceive as real. It is real and it is real. It's real and it is real. It's real and it is real. Welcome to my pick a card reading, and today I am going to start off with some different settings. So here I created some acrylic pour paint with crystal. So in today's Pika card reading, I don't have a specific theme, but I'm just going uh, by the flow. And by the way, this, this acrylic paintings are available on my new Etsy store called Alarm Arts. So if you guys are new to Pika card reading, I'm just going to give you a quick rundown of how it works. So basically you can choose one of this painting and the timestamps are below in description so choose the painting or a color or the shape of crystal that you're most drawn to if you pick the first image this is the message for you okay i'm just going to shuffle the cards I don't feel like using a lot of decks today. And then lastly, I'm going to use the Lenormand card for some details okay so let's find out what you've got you've got tree of life consumption Wonders, Universe, Walk in Beauty, and number one, Rider, which represents a litter. And then for a tarot card, oh, you've got the Ace of Cups. So definitely group number one, I'm feeling a fresh new beginning, possibly in your relationship. And I'm seeing this seed this reminds me of like you are finally getting out of hibernation mode and getting ready to go out and start connecting to people. Some of you guys would be wanting to be more socially active and some of you guys will uh, start making new friends. And right now, it's very important that you support yourself. You, you support your intentions by taking care of your social and emotional needs. This card makes me think of like you need to start honoring your own beauty. 
the more you see yourself as a beautiful being, the more you find the beauty inside and out, the outer external circumstances will reflect you back in the same manner. And this is also like the magician card in tarot. So, oh, and this is a Saturn and this looks like Jupiter. And by the way, this year, 2021, Jupiter and Saturn are in the same sign. So according to the whole sign system, even if they are like kind of like separating apart because Jupiter moves a lot faster than Saturn, but still, as long as they are in the same sign, in Aquarius, this position is considered. This to me feels like a lot of you guys are uh, reaching a maturity phase. You are finally learning the lessons, and especially if you guys are familiar with astrology, uh, I would recommend you take a look at your Saturn position because the more you start deploying self-discipline and become socially active by interacting people in your industry or uh, if you guys are in school, like you could start networking with professors or your classmates I don't know it could be different for everyone because this is a general reading but anyway uh, I feel that there is a strong need to mingle with other people because you are going to identify new opportunities in the social interaction a lot of you guys may be in the brainstorming stage, which makes sense because it's in January. A lot of people uh, plan out a lot of things for the rest for this new year. And even if you watch this video, not in January 2021, still um, this message can be resonating with you. And I'm also picking up a very specific message for perhaps like some people. I think your connection to nature and planting, you know, you see this plant uh, can help you get in touch with your inner self and finding more comfort in various ways. So it could be as simple as just taking a walk in the park. Try to uh, stay in touch with nature because this could be very refreshing and liberating in some way. Yeah, so I think that's about it. And I also want to uh, mention this painting. So okay, I'm just going to bring it here okay so the crystal in the center is clear quartz and in terms of chakra system uh, there are a lot of uh, like lower chakra system like solar plexus sacral and a little bit of uh, crown chakra energy the white and clear quartz i'm picking up a lot of healing energy so you could be healing your creativity, your emotional uh, relationships, like letting go of certain traumatic experience from the past. Letting go of emotional baggage is the key. And <clears throat> the more you do that, you'll be able to start afresh and start connecting to the people that you genuinely resonate with. Even though the cup represents relationship or a possible new romantic interest, I'm feeling like there would be a lot of opportunities. This is like gateway to opportunities. Stay open and stay positive. And remind yourself 
that you are good enough and beautiful enough. Walk in beauty. This is about trusting the process and having a good partnership with the universe or God, oneness, source, energy, whatever you want to call. They're all the same thing, basically. Okay, so that's about it. It was relatively a short reading and I hope you guys like it. And if you resonated with that, uh, make sure that you like and subscribe to my channel and leave a comment below to share how you resonate with it. Thank you. Hope you have a wonderful week. All right, so if you pick the second painting with this beautiful pink and orange with the clear quartz at the center, this is the rating for you. Okay, so while I'm shuffling, I am picking up the energy of something that is incomplete. It could be something that is missing or a room for improvement. Some of you might be a little bit of a um, perfectionist in getting really obsessed with a certain aspect. It could be about your project or relationship. It could mean different things because it's a general rating. Yeah, but I feel like some of you guys uh, would be waiting for a certain piece of information or message to make the right decision. So. Yeah, I feel like there is a little bit of waiting period. You've got journey, imagination. Valiant courage, valiant courage take action with passion. You've got the cloud and judgment. Okay, so the cloud represents Things are getting in balance. So if you have had a hard time recently, know that things are going to be much better sooner or later. If you have been uh, pretty good in terms of emotional state and other stuffs, note that this might be a good time to take a quick break and chillax before you get over exhausted so taking a short break could benefit some of you guys this does not mean that you need to take a whole day off but taking intermittent break can give you a fresh breath of air so yeah work around your schedule and your own environment Okay, so I feel like a lot of you guys are um, working towards your visions and your bold imagination, bold visions. It's very important that you take action with passion. So follow your highest excitement. And note that this can be a journey, like not a sprint. So, so again... For this reason, it's important that you pace yourself properly by taking a regular break and nourish your body and taking the right kind of nutrition. So uh, yeah, this would help you go a long way in the long term. And I feel like some of you guys are taking massive action. This card makes me think of a very strong solar plexus energy and 
with passion coupled together. I feel like you guys are definitely a great manifester. You guys have so much power to execute your plans and come up with great strategy. I feel like a lot of you guys are already feeling self-empowered, but if you're not, um, this good energy is coming forth sooner or later. So yeah, stay open and lighthearted. And this also uh, makes me think of humor. So lighten up yourself. Laughter itself can be very therapeutic, regardless of why you're laughing. Laughter itself has a huge benefits to your body and in tarot you've got judgment okay so this white space is matching with the white blotch white blotch in the painting so i feel like you guys would be evaluating uh the footprints you've been uh, making up to this point and making a new decision that can affect quite a long period of time in your future. I actually want to pick additional card to get more details. What is the white space about? You've got the Her Shocker card, self-love. You can only love others as much at as much as you love yourself. Okay, so I feel like some of you guys are being very harsh on yourself. You could be very lenient and permissive to others except for you. So now it's time for you to evaluate your own standards like how you evaluate yourself how you see yourself you could ask yourself am i trying to prove my worthiness if then why is it because you're not acknowledging your own self-worth is it because that there's something lacking inside of you which would be an illusion most of the time you need to be very clear about how you want to see yourself instead of just blindly taking what others are imposing on you no humans are social animals so we always interact with other people in some way, shape, or form, and their inputs can affect us. But note that they can affect you only when you allow them to do so. So always, you have the power, you have the real power to create your reality, your day, your life, your career, your relationship, your dreams, whatever, because you are simply the creator of your own life. So I feel like for group two, the action, execution part is no problem. You guys are very passionate. You guys can just set goals and hit them going with the full speed and strength but the thing is the evaluation part so this is about your mental framework the more you are genuinely fulfilled with who you are the more you are able to love yourself the better outcome you're going to get and better insight you will be able to have access to so yeah this is the message for you group number two those who picked this painting 
by the way this is available on my etsy shop lair marts so if you guys are interested in check it out and if you like this rating please like and consider subscribing to my channel and leave a comment below to share how you resonated with that this is going to really help my youtube channel to grow all right so thank you okay so if you pick the third painting this is the message for you as you can see a lot of a lot of things are going on in this painting a lot of colors I feel like a lot of you guys are experiencing multiple things on your plate. Let's find out what it is and what you need to hear. You've got navigating by the stars, follow your place. For tarot, you've got the King of Pentacles. You've got the Insects, Support. For the last card, you've got Storks. Alright, so let's take a look at it. Okay, so first of all, I feel like a lot of you guys are working on a little small details. Yeah, I really don't like bugs in general, but you know, insects are a fundamental part of the ecosystem. Even though their their physical sides are very small, they may appear to have relatively a lower level of power but really they support the entire ecosystem like some significant changes in insects word is going to are going to have huge impact on the entire ecosystem so i feel like you guys might be dealing with certain stuff that you don't quite enjoy at at this moment but this is going to be like a fundamental cornerstones of whatever you're building whether it be a career you know schooling um, relationships could mean different things because this is a general rating and I feel like uh, a lot of you guys will be about to harvest what you've sown. Stork represents a result, a tangible result, accomplishment. So especially with King of Pentacles, I feel like uh, a lot of you guys would be having monetary gains or this could be earning a title, possibly a promotion, or pay raise and getting recognized for your accomplishments and all those all the support and service that you've been doing for quite a long time and this dragonfly and butterfly makes me think of like a huge changes that are optional I recommend you taking a look at your surroundings and see if there if there are any chances that you may have been overlooking because I feel like ooh, you could be benefiting a lot by taking a different role or possibly scaling up you know when you think of butterfly this is such an interesting creature like caterpillar turns to what is it called i forgot the term in english 
caterpillar transformed into something and then butterfly that can fly so literally like they are transforming their entire body so from crawling creature to flying creature you could be doing some repetitive menial tasks which you may not quite enjoy even if you enjoyed it uh, you might have found it challenging to find the meaning in the job or in your routines this could be about relationship as well but i feel like things are changing and navigating by the stars as long as you follow your heart's desire and uh, again you need to look at the signs uh, for some of you guys you can shift your focus from the details to a bigger picture and in this way you can capture some amazing opportunities that can bring you more stability on a practical financial and uh, uh, material levels some of you guys would be celebrating uh, there are some events worth celebration and i want to talk about this painting the pop the purple color is popping as well as the yellow so again this represents a huge transformation and uh, compared to other other painting this one has a huge huge chunk of clear quartz so i feel like again <laughs> pentacles can be considered crystal or rock solid stuffs you guys are finally integrating all the different jobs tasks the mini tasks in a way that builds a huge structures that can umbrella everything around it in group three i feel like you guys are very talented and versatile you can have a little bit of everything you can do a little bit of everything as well so yeah now is a great time to integrate everything and in a cohesive way so finding the umbrella idea will be important for you to go on to the next step and scale up and level up so yeah this is the message for you guys number group number three and if you like this reading make sure you click like and consider subscribing to my channel if you haven't this painting is available on my etsy, etsy store Laramarts. and thank you for listening oh leave a comment below this is going to really help me grow my channel and i would appreciate it and thank you have a wonderful day and wonderful week.